Warning, this video is intended for audiences that are serious about building their social media marketing in order to skyrocket their sales through Instagram, TikTok, and YouTube. Before I begin this video, I would like to thank you for clicking on this YouTube video and share with you, if you stick around to the end of the video, I have an exclusive offer exclusive offer i mean if you want to just fast forward it i guess you could i'm not going to tell you where in the video but if you stick to the end of the video there's an exclusive offer just for you and then you can click the link in the bio to claim your offer i'm going to go over a client case study magnus medical a hormonal replacement company based out of las vegas nevada we've been working together since august 2023 and now it's early 2024 and sales have been boom here's the punchline the results they made six figures within the first week of us working together. We only made five posts. That's wild. That's a needle in the haystack type of result, and it's not guaranteed for every single client that's worked with me. But by using the five-step framework that I use with all of my clients, all the hundreds of clients I've worked with for the last decade, Magnus Medical has shown and proven that if you just follow everything to a T that I'm about to share with you in this YouTube video, you too can start seeing results skyrocketing your sales in your business. So that way you can stop saying Instagram is a waste, social media is a waste, TikTok is a dancing app. Every single negative connotation that makes you frustrated that social media isn't working and you're questioning why are you even on social media? So let's get into it. Before I get into my five step framework, I have to make a disclaimer that we did not do a single paid ad. It was all organic, short form content with a little bit of YouTube long form content. We didn't do a single influencer collab. It doesn't matter if there were millions of followers, only fans, celeb, nothing. It was straight up with the two owners of Magnus Medical creating organic, short form and long form pieces of content and they don't really have a big following at all. All we do is just post valuable educational pieces of content and it took off because people saw the value in it, they wanted to save it and they wanted to share it and they really felt like it helped them in their day-to-day -day life. Another key takeaway is that we did the basic foundations of social media strategy, consistency, personal branding, staying consistent with like how your brand voice, your brand messaging, all that type of stuff, your fonts, your colors. When you think of Nike, you think of the swoosh, and when you think of McDonald's, you think of that yellow M. Whatever the color and the branding that represents that company, we made sure every single piece of content, it actually showed that it was Magnus Medical. Without further ado, here's the five-step framework that you can start using right now and start making your videos actually convert, start generating you sales, and stop making you think and complain that social media doesn't work. So my five-step framework consists of a negative hook, an alternative option, a promise, solution, and finally a call to action. Every single piece of media starts with a hook. We have it in movies and especially with talking head videos. No one wants to sit and listen to someone ramble that has no credentials and they're boring. So we think of a negative hook. Negative hooks are something that would make you feel emotionally triggered something that will almost feel like it's talking to your pain point. And sometimes you feel a little offended, but it's just to hook you. It's not to make you actually feel offended. Let's take an example of the five-step framework by using the topic of building your glutes. You're never going to build your ass if you continue to make this one mistake. That's an example of a negative hook. Unfortunately, people only connect to negative things. We, for some reason, cannot feel hooked by something that's positive. So by implementing something negative, you're causing the viewer to want to stop scrolling and watch the video. So when they're scrolling and they hear a negative statement with a you statement calling you out, the viewer, and it feels like it's actually connecting with them because they might feel self-conscious about them having a small ass, they're gonna watch your video. The whole point is to not make them feel offended. It's just to make them feel like they just got hit in their pain points. That is what makes people want to watch a video. They feel connected to what you are speaking about. Now let's do the alternative option. So here are three tips in order to stop having a small ass for the rest of your life. Now to the alternative option that comes right after the hook, making people feel like, oh wow, I actually have a little bit of saving here. This person's about to give me information on how to get rid of my small butt and start actually building it. Here are three tips to make your small little butt into the juiciest one that your husband's never gonna wanna stop grabbing. The step two was the three tips. 
to help start building your booty. So if a woman has a man, they're probably building their butt for themselves and also for their man so they can get grabbed on. So that is a little bit of like that promise that is further putting icing on the cake to wanna make the viewer continue watching because they already got emotionally hooked from you calling them out, saying that they have a small butt. You just gave them three tips. You're about to give them three tips on how to cure it. And you gave them a promise, which is a pretty good promise. Girls like having their butt grabbed by their guy, which will then lead us into step four of the framework, which is the solution. We're now gonna talk about the three tips that you just mentioned. Now, this is where you go into the meat and potatoes of your content, giving the solutions on how the viewer can finally address their pain point of having a small butt. So three tips for that could be not hitting hip thrusts, lack of range of motion, and just not hitting the glutes in the entirety the correct way. We have different parts of the glute, so you're not hitting it on all the parts, the, all the angles to build it the best proper way that you could. After you go through the meat and potatoes and give your solution on how to fix the problem, now you do the call to action. The call to action could be anything like, DM me a peach emoji if you wanna learn how to build your glutes. Or DM me the peach emoji so I can send you a free booty building guide. Whatever you wanna do. You can even just say DM me a peach if you want to. You can even say DM me a peach so I can send you a booty guide. Some sort of call to action or even like follow me for more. You wanna tell your viewer to do something. And sometimes you don't have to do a call to action either. It all depends on how your content strategy is and if you want to feel like you have to implement it in that video. What my rule of thumb is, if I'm gonna film five pieces of content, I'll make four of them without a call to action, and on the fifth one, I make a call to action. I try to tell all my clients we're gonna post about 20 reels a month, so when you do the math, you know, every fifth reel will have a call to action. So that way, the viewers, the audience doesn't feel like you're always selling. The key trick is to provide value, value, value. That is it. Selling and the money just comes naturally. The more free education you give, the more people want to pay for you anyway at that point. I hope that example helps you. And in the description box, I'm going to have this graphic that I built out, which has the five-step framework with an example, as well as a little bit of an explanation on every step. So please feel free to look over it and use it when you're creating your content. Now into content ideas. We made content ideas based off of Magnus Medical being the expert in their field. It was pretty easy to come up with topics when you know what you're talking about. We just used either what we wanted to talk about, what their patients were talking about throughout the day, so they would write stuff down, they would remember something, just whatever was happening into their present day life, and it's a current problem, so we would talk about it. And finally, if we needed some help, we would chat GPT it. I'm gonna put in the description also a chat GPT prompt that you can use for any niche that you can find and generate some of the best scripts, the best viral content ideas, so that way you don't feel like you're ever gonna be stuck creating content again. Just by doing these things that I've gone over in this YouTube video, we were able to create consistent content posting every single day, Monday through Friday. And the craziest thing is, within the first five posts of us working together, somehow we went viral on TikTok, causing them to have an influx of 200 patients a month coming in. That caused them to literally make six figures in the first week of us working together. And I'm sure you know that solidified Magnus Medical wanting to work with us. Those results are definitely one a million. And I will disclose that because Magnus Medical is a hormonal replacement company, it is a lot more relatable to the entire population for your basic general health versus a fitness coach who may not be able to speak to every single audience. Everyone has a different definition of fitness. Some people don't like to diet. Some people have different types of diets. And sometimes you just don't speak to the right audience. And Magnus Medical, we just got lucky with our brand voice, our brand messaging, the style, even the personality of the people talking. It really allowed for the viewers to connect and it supported us in going viral in one of our videos. And we don't recommend ever going viral. It just worked out in this scenario. I'll make another YouTube video on why you should never want to go viral. But Magnus Medical went viral within the first couple of posts that we did, thus causing them to get over 200 patients every single month, therefore generating over six figures. And they were already a seven figure business 
We just generated more money. And so they want to increase our retainer with us. We never ran out of content ideas. We constantly were making sure to film and backlog a lot of videos and we were consistent. We made sure every single Monday through Friday there was a post and we were constantly engaging with the community so no comment was ever left on turn. And since Magnus has signed up with us in August, they've only gotten super happy with their results, became a full believer of social media content strategy and they're just really happy that their investment paid back tenfold. I hope this YouTube video has been super helpful, super informative. And if there's any questions, please feel free to leave a comment in the comment section below. My personal contact is in the description box below. And like I mentioned at the very beginning of the video, an exclusive offer for those of you who are watching this YouTube video, here's the offer. In the link in my bio, there's a Calendly link. There's going to be no cost, no anything for a free strategy call one hour that I will give you if you click the link in the bio through this YouTube video. Yep, you heard me. The exclusive offer is a free strategy call. We're gonna go through your profile optimization. We're gonna go through all the content that you've been producing and I'm gonna give you the everything you need to know about why it is or isn't working, how we can fix things, tweak things to make it further. You know, let's really try to build your personal brand and take things to the next level. It's, it's completely free. Normally I charge $500 for a profile consultation, but for those of you that come through the YouTube channel, it's absolutely free. So book a call with me if you'd like to talk. And by the end of that call, I hope you took away some value. We got to dive deep into your social media strategy and all of your content, see what is and isn't working. And if you didn't think I was that annoying, then no, maybe I can keep working with you and we can get you to the next level and make more money than ever before through Instagram, social media, and TikTok. So I appreciate you guys watching this YouTube video. Reach out if you have any questions and would love to work with you if you are interested in working with me and growing your Instagram, growing your social media, skyrocket your sales. Peace.